Hey guys, I'm here with Nelson from Velocity Systems today. Today we're taking a more serious note in that we're with a company that does really amazing work for a lot of the military and law enforcement community that is out there doing some really amazing stuff, doing some really risky stuff as well, making things that they need to depend on when they need it the most. So, Nelson, please, thank you very much for coming on TFB TV. Thank you guys for, for coming. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. it. Um, please take us off and tell us about your new products for 2018. Sure. So, um, Scarab DLX um, is one of the new products we're showcasing this year. The DLX is a playoff of our current Scarab setup, Scarab uh, being one of our more popular carriers, one of the lighter carriers that we've ever ever, ever made. Um, the DLX, the way it's different is, as opposed to having your traditional Molly, it is laser cut um, right into the fabric. We decided to go with triangles for the simple reason that triangles are proven to be the strongest of the geometric shapes. Um, so the beauty of this is it's still plenty of space for those of us with big fat stubby fingers when we're trying to molly stuff, yeah. easy to get your fingers in there. Um, another feature about this um, that's a little different than, than our traditional scarab is the fact that the material that we're using actually contains um, tensile, uh, harder tensile strength dyneema type fibers in it. Why is that important? Um, guys, other systems that we've seen, guys have complained that, you know, you put a couple of mags, fully loaded mags on here, they leave them after their classes, they don't take them off till later, and they get a sag in the material. The idea with the fibers inside is because they're so much stronger than traditional thread, when you let it go, you can tell, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it kind of retains its original, original shape. So you're not going to get any sag over the course of time. So there's a, a big durability factor to it. In fact, the threads will probably wear out way before any of the material on this actually wears out. Other than that, it retains a lot of the traditional um, features of our scarab, our, our patented swivel shoulders in there. We've got kind of a little bit of a new shoulder pad where it just opens up and you can actually adjust the length of the shoulder pad just by opening it, kind of a ah. dual fold. So now you can make it longer or shorter. And that's the probably if you're running stuff, uh, hoses, wires, that kind Correct. of thing. Also helps with, absolutely helps with um, uh, comms wire guide management, keep everything kind of neat and in place. Um, another feature that you'll notice a, a different from, that is different from a traditional scarab, it's got a, our traditional one had a lot bigger real estate here for patches and stuff. This one, because it was originally done for um, particular groups, um, has a smaller IR patches, flag patches, etc. Um, now, the big, big, big feature on this carrier is actually going to be the, the internal system. So the internal system is made up of this special material goes inside. If you can tell that the whole, there's holes cut into that. It's actually for um, to create uh, reduce weight. So this system, you can adjust how far you when you put it on. And we, can, we can maybe put it on you here in a second. I'll adjust it. Um, when you put it on the body, you can adjust how far off the body you want to keep it. You want to keep it a little bit closer. You want to get a little bit further. What this has done is it reduces uh, back face deformation excuse me, <clears throat> significantly. So now we're probably looking at about a 50, 56 percent reduction in, in, in back face. What does that translate to? It translates to you're wearing this vest with, say, for our, our BZ plates, which is one of our best selling plates. Walk into a place, your military law enforcement, don't see the bad guy. The bad thing happens, you take one round right on your plate as opposed to putting you down on your butt, as opposed to taking you out of the fight, energy displacement is gonna go sideways, you, you'll be able to stay in the fight and do what you need to do to get out alive. So it, it's, it's a huge step in, in energy displacement, but it's on the carrier, it's not on the plates, and a lot of times people wanna shape the plates in a way where the energy displacement is, it's plate dependent. This isn't like that. It's the actual carrier that's gonna do it. And this Velcro over here is strong enough to be able to keep this form here while you're wearing it with uh, mags on it, with plates on it. With Ab absolutely, so one of the things, if you know anything about Velocity Systems, is we're 100% very compliant. All our products are US made. We don't import you know, hook and loop from, from anywhere outside the US. We use the actual Velcro brand. Velcro stands by, by its brand. Um, we stand by it. You know, I, I've got a plate carrier, original um, APC uh, from, from our Mayflower line that I've probably had it for seven years, the Velcro on is still brand new. I, I talked to guys in the industry, when we started 10 years ago, bought their carriers and still tell me their Velcro is just as strong 
now as it was on day one 10 years ago. That's fascinating. So, so we, we, we don't, you know, we always tell people we're not the cheapest in the business, but you're going to get what you pay for. We're going to use quality materials. We've done it. We're doing it with this as well. All the materials are also all made in the U.S. as well. Outstanding. Is there anything else you want to talk about with this particular system? Cummerbunds, very similar. If you look at our traditional scarab, you'll notice the difference between the mesh, the mesh cummerbunds with the molly, and now you've got your triangular shapes in there. But you can still do everything you can put on this, you can put on this. We will be working on a, a system where guys can get um, armor for the sides. Not quite there 100% yet, but it, it is coming. So we are going to be, you are going to be able to set it up as you would your traditional scarab. Um, only difference is, um, maybe you can fill it, but it's almost, it's about half a pound lighter than, than your than the earlier than one. The earlier scarab. Yeah. This was already the lightest plate carrier that we have. This is even lighter. Mm. That's a significant reduction in weight. Absolutely. Weight that I can better take up with more ammunition or better radios or whatever. Ounces equals pounds. That's what everybody in the industry says. Ounces mm -hmm. equals pounds. If you're a and pounds equal pain. If you're a runner, a hiker, a backpacker, if you're somebody like me, you know, when you're once you turn 50, you're looking for the lightest material you can. Bad knees, bad backs, thanks to the military, military service. You know, it is what it is, proud of it, but I need the lightest thing that I can possibly get on my body. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, can we talk about the chest rig that you guys have? Absolutely. We do have a large selection of chest rigs that we've always had. We do a lot of custom custom chest rigs, a lot, a lot of traditional ones, triple mag, four mags, pouches for flash mags, general purpose pouches, etc. Um, we've been asked, you know, by people, we want to set something up ourselves. We want it as light as possible. So employing the technology that we had from our new Scarab DLX and using um, hypalon material for the shoulder straps, now you've got one of the lightest chest rigs that you can possibly get to start with, and then f you start building from there. Your selection of pouches, you can get lighter, light materials for pouches. Um, everything, again, mollied exactly the way that you would molly anything else. You notice that this one is kind of a different shape. It's not triangular. We did that because that's kind of your starting point just to tell you how high you should go without getting outside of the material when you start to molly. So basically it's, um, you know, uh, dummy proof where this mm -hmm. is where you should start here, please. Yeah. Um, yeah. Same, same thing on the material. It's got the same type of retention to it. It's got the same type. I mean, you can sit there and we can try and tug on it. And it, it's gonna take it's gonna take a bit of strength for that to, 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 to mess yeah. up. You pull it really hard. If you let it go, it comes back. Wow! Iron, iron those out, and the yeah. material comes right back to where it's supposed to, it's supposed to go. I was yanking on that thing. I was I yanking saw, saw really hard. Your fingers were getting red. Yeah. But yeah. so it's super light material, and again, the hypalon sh the hypalon um, shoulder straps, which is different from the Cordura that we've used in the past on, on all our other chest rigs. Mm -hmm. Set this one up yourself, your configuration, you're happy with it, but you're starting with the lightest possible material that you can have, but there is absolutely no durability issue with the material. Again, ounces equals pounds, and we're going to start you off on your kit with the lightest possible thing you can get. So, question, say, say I'm running uh, say I'm running with plates mm -hmm. and I've got my carrier, but I'm also running with no plates and I got this guy. Mm -hmm. You know, say worst case scenario, I need to throw on my plates, but I don't have my mags on here. I can unclip this Correct. and clip it right onto there. So we're going to continue to have the same system that we've had with, with all our chest rigs, where you can take it off and we have our, our swift grip system and you can get your chest rig. Oh, where are we? There we go. You get your chest rig plugged right into there. And then with the use of our swift clip system, you can get that and molly it on the sides. Now you've got, it has a pull strap so you can cinch that in really tight. Now you've got all your magazines and everything on the front. So we'll have your placards, which are your smaller ones, but if you need to go with a bigger load, you need more mags, now you have to have your flash mags on there, your grenades or anything else, your IFAC, and, they, and you can run them on your chest rig. So longer mission profile, you've got everything set up on the big one. Shorter mission profile, we've got smaller swift clips, placards that, that we will have. 
Cool. Well, Nelson, thank you so much for coming out today. We really appreciate it. Thank you guys for being here. And I'm sure a lot of our viewers can appreciate this. And certainly, we definitely appreciate the difference that you guys are making in a lot of the lives of our guys overseas and in law enforcement communities across the United States. We definitely try to do the best we can. We appreciate what law enforcement and military community do. We appreciate what guys like you do getting the word out there. Um, www.velsis.com. All our things, uh, all our items are on there. DLX will be ready as soon as we get we get back home. Um, okay. Which hopefully will be soon because we're starting to get tired. <laughs> for, for those Mill LE customers, when will this be available? This is going to be available. It's on the website right now. Right. We, now. we actually activated on the website when we step foot off the plane uh, Monday. So it's people are watching this video if they're Mill LE, they can get with their www.velsis.com. Just click on on. Uh, chest rigs or click on plate carriers, you'll see both of these items there. Outstanding. Thank you so much. Perfect. Thank you guys. Appreciate it.